Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. As you guys know, I'm on sick week with my two sons and Jamie. We just got a new battery put into the Freedom Civic. Will it start? Pulling up now, and uh, we're here. We're trying to make this thing a little faster. These pits are really tight, so uh, we're trying to squeeze in next to Cooper right here and uh, see if we can get some done. Find my son. I think he's lost. Uh, our pump is dripping, so something we have to watch here. All right, guys, we're in the lanes now. We just put this thing in race mode. Where's a uh, panic do so I didn't really show anything but we are in the lanes uh, Jamie looked and we're currently fourth place right now and we gotta go pretty fast to take 50s the rest of the week yeah we'd have to go pretty fast to um, but those move other, up to third those other three guys there's they can have problems too yeah that's gotten me got, from like fifth to third before and there's two days left there's today and then we drive and then we are back at Orlando that's it that's the last day so we're gonna see what we can do, and uh, hopefully we can get a little faster. All right, made it to the lane. Thank you. 
All right, guys, as you guys saw, we got a little wild. Sorry. <laughs> you don't gotta be sorry. We, we don't know the limit of something unless we give it to it, so. Um, is Eric's gonna airdrop you a video. Woo! Mint? Mint, there was some smoke coming off the back tire. Are you wanting to go again today or are we gonna call that good and just go to the next guy? What do you wanna do? Uh, yeah, I don't know. I wanted to go fast. Yeah, I want to go fast too. You know what? Oh, those are awesome. So what, uh, what are we seeing here? The hit was just spicy. You pedaled it too. Was that still 22 pounds ish? Or? No. How much boost was that? 26. 26? You want to go fast, don't you? <laughs> just think we didn't pick up many mile an hour because of the spinning? Yes. So we didn't have a bunch from the 8 to the the end you know all right see you later i just it was really it was pretty heavy because we're up in that part of the map that we just had padded okay on the correction like where it was targeting yeah so i just fixed that which will help a lot yeah it's fun so we got the data we'll uh see if we can figure out change it up go back out do it again. And for everybody again. that yelled at you for not lifting, you lifted for a second. Yeah. Had to get her straight. You pedaled it. It was enough to straighten her out. Now go. <laughs> Let's look at your shifts real quick. See, you pull soft on one, two. So when it was spinning, your hand was on it still. You could see it went forward on the voltage. You came back to center, forward. And then you were on it a touch, on it a touch. So you were still while it was spinning, you know, and I know it's spinning, it's turning, your hand's there. You're just doing you're, it. You're hunting for it because you came off the e-brake and came for it, and then the car's still moving, but... I mean, look at the fuel's flat, the boost is flat. Probably hard to see in the glare, but... This isn't the same gear ratio as yours, the final. I think this is a 4.7. I have a 4.3. Yeah, this yeah, is a four this seven. Is a four seven. Cause he's going through in fourth gear on that one at eighty four. He went through yesterday at one hundred fifty something. In fifth. In fifth at eighty four yeah, fifty or eighty five hundred. Yeah. And driving down the highway, I can tell cause it, like fifty five, fifty five to sixty mile an hour. I'm like thirty five hundred, thirty six hundred RPM. So. I do want to change the final in this eventually. For quarter, just, for eighth mile shit, that's I great. I just, I just turn it up and make sure you're using all a fifth. Yeah. Well, oh, no, we're, we're using all a fifth. It's if we start that's trying to go. That's the top of fifth gear right now? Yes. To go one fifth? Top of fifth. Well, we're at 8,400 in fifth. We got a couple hundred more. I remember it was at 88 or 89. We don't have the greatest stuff in the head on this, so I'm not, uh, I'm not okay. singing it. I don't want to sing it like we do yours. Yeah, yeah. Yours, I, I you have a lot more heads. I thought you were going to go fourth gear. No, that's fifth. That's fifth. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. We've got a four a seven final. Because yeah. this is first gear, second, third, fourth, fifth. I mean, how fast are you guys realistically going to try to go with it one day? What would be the overall goal? Eight well, fives. Yeah, regular mid to Eight fives, regular We, we could probably stretch I mean, it. Would do we that could probably you stretch it. head on it. But. It'd probably make that, that first. Help, that helps you. It'd, it yeah, helps but you. So you want to make. If you got the sequential, it's something we don't do on the MR2. But if you got, you want to use all fit. Yeah. And uh, I think it'd, it'd just help me some in first if it's knocking off the tires to have longer gear to. But if I can get yeah, it but, to just hook but, up, well, yeah. You got to get track, then yeah. it's going to be an advantage. Exactly. All right. Well. I've got you fixed. I'd like you to make one more. Okay. Um, I do want to put top hat. If you could pull the injectors real quick, switch four and one, and put new top hats all the way across. Well, Goof, how you doing? Doing all right. Doing all right? Yeah. Getting good grades? Yeah. Future looks bright. What's our plan this lap? We're just gonna try and make it up the track again. So you gotta try and get some better data, maybe some tune up. Yeah, and it's front wheel drive now. Yeah, it's front wheel drive. We just need to get it down the track and uh, back to the next track. And then we finish the week at least, you know? Yep. And then we can tear into the car and find all.
all these little bugs and get them out of it. Over the winter when they sit, it's just those things. All right, here comes Goofy. Front wheel drive. We know the clutch is kind of hurt. He's gonna try to take it easy and just get down the track. My poor kiddo, he's had a week. But you know he keeps pushing forward. And trying to persevere through the week.
Oh, she's making me drive her. At least we're having some fun. It's a good time. Well, buddy, I think I have an idea. What do you got? I think the front diff's broke. So as I've been driving, I started noticing that hum, remember? Yeah, yeah. I think the front diff's broke. So you remember that back piece that loosened? I checked that right before the pass, so it's not any of the rear stuff driving around. Yeah. yeah. It's got a hum. And remember Derek's, the the wave track, after we ran it forever, it broke. And it started making that hum and driving around. It's exactly what this is acting like. Maybe uh, we we'll try some... Uh, Transfer yeah, maybe we dump it right when we get to the track tomorrow. Yeah, put some, get put some fresh stuff in. So, but I, I think that's what it is. I honestly think it's the front diff. Well, we have it jacked up to do the tires. Oh, it's bad. You were in the paint. Yeah, I was worried I was gonna cross for a second. You were in the paint. I didn't hit the line though, did I? I don't think so. I don't think I did either. But. So I felt like I reeled it in quick enough. Yeah, it was way over there. You were in the blue paint. <laughs> yeah. Before the. I, I felt. I felt yeah. it going. Yep. I'm gonna have to aim myself a little. <laughs> I I really feel like it's the diff though. Yeah. I hate to say it, but that's Something the. Something on the drive probably then. The drive or when it knocked the tires yesterday. When it knocked them, oh, it might have yeah. done it. You know, what I mean, a couple dead hooks and then a nice spin. Yeah. Might have done it. It does so, happen, yep. but we got a better pass that was faster. Yeah. And down track it feels fine. Yep. Just on the lead. I want to look because I think the fuel probably helped it. Was there a little more mile an hour there? Nope, less. Less mile an hour? Less at the eight and less at the, fifth, at the finish. Okay. To try to figure out if that front diff has got a problem or not and uh, kind of go from there. If it does, then we'll just try to do the same thing in Orlando. It might make the move, but I'll uh, know it and I'll aim for it. So, that's where we're at here, guys. We're gonna make this trek and uh, try to get to Orlando and complete the week. That's the ultimate goal over everything. Goofy, as you guys saw, he's, I don't see, the fuel system's just so rough in it right now and the clutch is toast. You know, we're just trying to finish at this point. I mean, if he's still driving, we're still, we're still going, so. It's a tough week. Sometimes that happens. All right, guys, so Jamie and I put this thing on four jack stands. We're going to drive in the air just to double check what the heck we think is going on. All four spin, but... That's what I mean. That's the noises Derek's was making when I broke it. Alright, you guys are all set. Uh, three stops today. Three stops. Okay, thank you. We could try that. We could try turning it, leaving easier, and maybe it would clamp more. Yeah. We're uh, we're just talking about that differential. It's super weird. It's kind of LSD. So the fact that we're spinning the front one tire, the front right tire says that uh, it ain't doing its job. And we put this trans together so long ago. Yes. But we swear it's a Quave LSD, which is gears, not yeah. clutches. Yes, yeah. So we're not sure, but, you know, it still drives, so we're still going to be able to make the drive, and then or we think we may just dump the fluid in Orlando, and if it's, uh, you know, if it's got discs inside the differential, we'll put new fluid in there, and maybe that would help. And maybe just try to leave it a little softer, and... Maybe I can get a handle on it. That's all I can think of. So that's where we're at. So we got the car back in. Uh, we got the car back in street mode. So we'll hit the road jack. And head on down to Orlando. It was a nice track day, though. It was. It was good. I really wish it would have drove straight, but we're gonna try to drain fluid. Like I said, try some stuff when we get to Orlando. What's up? So. All right, we got some fluid or something. We didn't get very far out of Gainesville. No, we just got up to speed and it, I started seeing fluid. On the <laughs> yeah, let's check us out. Water.
drip. Oh, I just saw it drip. No, I've been watching it drip. I'm just trying to figure out where it's coming from. Try to keep going. We got a little water leak. We'll try to get to the gas station and then fix it there. So we're getting spit over on the windshield. We're gonna have to check that out. Okay, so we got a feeling we might have nipped the gasket. We're gonna we're gonna find out right now. We got it cooled off and the pressure out of the hose. If the pressure comes right back when he starts it, then we know. It's a cool little trick to find out. I think that he might be right. We might have just been down on water and got some air. All right, well, that's a good sign. Yeah. Huh? That's what ours has been doing. That's what yours has been doing? Yeah, that's why we taste That's water. why I've got three oh, water. Okay, like so maybe we just need to check it more often. Yeah. Yep. The Hoo Owl Farmhouse Ice Cream Shop. And this is pretty awesome. Let's go, Cooper! What a good drive, huh, son? Huh? Car's yeah. staying good on temperature and everything now? It's getting warm. What's warm to you? Warm to me is over to 12. Okay. It's boiling my water. Okay. And then I'm losing water and then I'm going to get warmer. Yeah, we run around 225. Woo! Yeah. Man, the funniest video I've ever seen is you with Emilio driving YouTube. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. You're so, sorry. oh, you're fine. <laughs> you're fine. So we treat it's all real wheel drive the same as front wheel drive. Okay. Because the backs are just helping it along anyway. So right. treat it like front wheel drive, get all the traction there, and let the back help push. Is that solid steel goes down there? It's, it's, how much does that it's thing weigh? 280. It's, it's definitely strong. Yeah, for sure. I've been on people's back decks that feel sketchier than this. <laughs> yeah, it's solid. This thing feels. I can haul whatever with that thing. How's the car? I don't know if you're gonna be able to get him out of the driver's seat. Probably not. <laughs>
<laughs> we just stopped for a second and I just found this. What? This is awesome. I looked back here and I was like, what the heck is this? Oh, they got me, man. <laughs> I know, you should have seen the look on your face. Just jumped. Here he comes, one headlight and all. We just saw that. Yeah, you ever driven down? See the uh, lid of the cooler? Yeah, you ever driven down Daytona with no lights? <laughs> yeah, I haven't, but I know a kid that did it once. It's definitely sketchy. Whoa, whatever that is, got it. What was it? Well, he touched the plug, so yeah, it's all, probably... It's just got two spades in there pushed on to... Too much vibration. Okay, I brought the, the Deutsch kit. Huh? I brought a Deutsch kit. I guess we could replug it. Let's just fix it for now and then replug it tomorrow. Or when we get home. We'll run the whole car. Last time and he's driving night. Yeah, last time. Good to see you. Good to see you too. How do you like the ocean drive? It's still 217 all the way down the water. Man, we were 201. But how'd it look? Like it was cool. The houses are nice and stuff. I liked it. Yeah, I know you like architecture. Stephen and stuff, liked. So. He saw a house that was like pirate themed. That pirates, fake pirates. Oh, on over. the top. Yeah, yeah I filmed it. Yeah, I filmed that pirate house. Yeah, it was cool. That was yeah, cool. there's pirates everywhere. Yeah, just yeah. on the roof. I was They're looking. Everywhere. I was like, those people just hanging out, and then I was like, oh, fake pirates. <laughs> <laughs> I thought okay, that was super cool. I thought the same thing. I was like, wow, there's a lot of people. Oh wait, never mind. They're running. Look at the pirates, man. <laughs> right. <laughs> Fake what do you read? What? That was checkpoint two. We just went. At? Yeah. yeah. So we've, I've got it pulled up on GPS. Yeah. We're just gonna. They said we can take any route yeah, to three. Propane because of, leak or something? Yeah, gas yeah, leak. My backfires will blow that up. Probably. Oh uh, yeah, you ready to head there? I just got it. I know, but we've been waiting. I hours. think he wants to cool down. That's what I see. Give him a second. Yeah. We've waited. I'll pour water on the radiator. And move on. Yeah, when I, so earlier I touched the back radiator and it was cold. Yeah, it was like, I don't think it works very good. Pump. I think the pump needs to go the other direction. I'm telling you. I think, the pump I think it will, good. I think it'll fix it all going the other way. I'm telling this you. Pump definitely if we're not trying to draw the through the radiator, I think it, it does. Well, last year we didn't get, we never got hot. Not a single week of getting hot. It's That's why I think it, I think the inlet and outlet are flipped. I think pulling through the, I don't think it's got enough punch to pull through the radiator. I think it's got to punch through the radiator. Then it's fighting the motor. No, it's not. It's, it's not. easier on the motor because it doesn't have to draw through a straw. Yeah, it's and fighting. the motor isn't forcing it through the radiator. See what he's saying? The water pump is assisting this water pump. I know, but it's not good enough because we're still getting hot. the other way, this water pump is going to flow into the head of that water pump. No, he's not he's saying the other way. He's saying on the other side of this radiator. I'm on the, I'm saying to come all he's saying is in come into the pump out back into the radiator. It's all just doing the same right thing. Now it's after the radiator. He's saying put it before the radiator because that water pump isn't pushing it into So the, the, the one that comes out of the engine comes into the pump, out of the pump, into the radiator, and then back into the motor. That's what he's I'm saying. saying. Because right now the engine is trying to go all the way to the back the radiator then to the pump. Yeah, because I touched it at the ice cream place and it was cold. That tells me it ain't doing nothing. So it's the pump before or after the radiator? After the radiator. After the radiator. That's exactly so how the mechanical strength went all the way through. It did, but it's not. That's what I'm saying. I think it was the... Maybe is trash. No, it's no, not. It's way better than the pump you had. You're doing the same thing you're talking about. That, the part you and Wyatt did is not changing. The only difference is we're coming into the radiator and then back out. That is it. 
right? Yes. Yes. You're right. Yeah, man. You're welcome to it. A couple little fun hot rods for sure. So cool. Yeah, I drove right past the cop down Daytona. I didn't even care. Cooler's hanging open. Lights flashing at him. He freaking parks it in the sand, though. Oh, yeah. yeah. Well, Steven's like, like pull over. There's nowhere to pull sand. over. Like, I'm going to gonna... pull over in the lane? Like, so I, the bike I did pull over. over. So I take a passenger, the passenger and we into the sand. And he pulls into the sand. And the sand's deep, you know? So that's throwing sand everywhere. I got out of it. <laughs> pulls into the I looked sand. in my mirror and it was just like a smoke screen. I don't know what he was doing. <laughs> One of the Sick the Mac guys, dude, he ran over and was taking a picture. I was dying. And I was like, oh my God. <laughs> it's still all dry. We just pulled right out of there. I've the seen sand. Alex do it. <laughs> Alex beached his. He drove right out. The sand. Beached his. No, no, no. Alex dipped the front tires. I dipped a front tire. No. Well, technically, and a trailer, yes, but it would have been a rear also. Yeah. And a rear open diff. What? That has no drive shaft. Exactly. No shaft. I'm just saying, even if it was all-wheel drive, the rear yeah, diff is open. It. Right. All right, you boys ready? I know that car's cool enough now, so. Yeah, it'll, it'll be hot in like two seconds. You got an air pocket then. I know I do. He's even been trying to get it out, but you. <laughs> Alright, follow us. He's like, I know I do. Our power probe died, so we took the boost solenoid. We're trying to figure out these headlights. So we're just trying to see if there's power in ground. We're not using the boost solenoid right now, so we cut it out. Yeah, we have no test light. Okay. It definitely works. It's clicking. So we got power in ground. Definitely clicking. Alright, so. All right, Shane. Oh, All right, so we did finally end up losing that headlight. Here, What's that? Any more tools need to go back in here? I don't think so. All right, yeah, we lost. So we lost that headlight. So we uh, grabbed ourselves some Chick Fil A, and uh, we uh, rigged up an LED. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna try that. Get it to the hotel. One day left, and uh, we'll finish the week. All right, we're rolling. Awesome here, honestly. Let's see what everyone's up to. 260. 260. Right on. The guy behind me was such an awesome guy, dude. He turned both his brights on and was my headlights. The guy behind me had a bright on the driver's side. He got on the trailer and scooted over so it was just bright in my mirror. I know it's still plugged in. What do we got going on here, Peter? I don't know. Checkpoint. We're dealing with a water issue, a headlight issue. Goofy's car is dealing with some issues. We're going to have to do some serious combing of that hot rod. Freedom Civic's been doing really good. Um, not much to say. She's been cruising. Hopefully we can run fast tomorrow. There is a rooster here. <laughs> Alright. Let's hit the road jack.
good turnaround. Dang it. All right, let's go see what's up. Okay. It's really hot. Really hot. I, yeah. All right. Might be really hot. The radiator and the that radiator and this radiator are totally cold. Ice cold. Ice cold. Engine's just hot. Pumps yeah. are fighting each other. We're flipping yeah. the hoses. Yeah, I'm saying, but before we pop the hoses off, we should probably pop that cap. I don't know if we can. <laughs> or penny sales tax. That works. Training improvement. <laughs> we are so close. <laughs> We're 15 miles from the track. Yeah. And 15 miles from there to the hotel. So you 30 know what miles. That means? We're 30 miles away. From completing. Well, well and then another 15 from, miles. From so. getting yeah. tonight. 45. Yeah, from, from tonight. 45. Completing. 45 and a quarter. Really 15 miles from completing if we were to sleep at the track. So we flipped the hoses. And we're going to try it and see if this thing will stay cool. This last little bit, it was just getting hot and having these crazy temperature swings. And yeah, it sounds like head gasket and all, but, but both radiators are super cold. as fast as we want <clears throat> we didn't go as fast as we wanted but we had a ton of fun and uh jamie and i are going to try to scan the freedom civic and see if we can find out why it was pulling like that to that side if we can't i'm i'm afraid that the next pass might have a little sideways action as well because we need to finish sick week and we need to have some fun so um uh, yeah we're gonna get parked for the night guys jump on pfispeed.com grab the i love pfi t-shirt means the world to me. Just so sick that we could all do this together and uh, bring you along on our little journey. You know, the boys have gotten so much closer and the whole team has just been clicking and that's what really counts in this whole thing. Absolutely get it figured out. We already all got plans of tackling it as a team and uh, making sure that sucker rocks. He's got some really big goals and I'd like to see them come into fruition. So I'm gonna call it there tonight. Appreciate you guys watching. Give us a like, subscribe, and we'll see you guys all tomorrow.